Hey there, everybody. Today, I'm going to walk you through a few different ways you can check if your website is using Quip and HTTP3. So let's get started. First, open a browser and go to http3check.net. Input your domain name in the search box and click search. If you end up with two green check marks saying Quick is supported and HTTP3 is supported, then both are supported. These boxes list the version supported by the website. If you receive a different message when searching a website, please check the error given. The next way to check if a website is using Quick or HTTP3 is with an extension on Chrome. If you do not already have the extension HTTP2 and Speedy Indicator, then please get it now. Once you've added it, please open up the website you'd like to check using Google Chrome. You should have a blue lightning bolt symbol in the search bar. A blue lightning bolt means HTTP2 is supported. Next, refresh the page. If the lightning bolt is now green, it means Quick and possibly HTTP3 are supported. When you hover over the lightning bolt, it will show the Quick and HTTP3 versions. Now, let's move on to a third way to check if Quick and HTTP3 are supported on your website. While on your website in Chrome, click on the ellipsis, then choose More Tools from the drop-down menu, then Developer Tools. Make sure you are on the Network tab, then right-click Type and make sure protocol is selected. If it's not, then select it. Now, under protocol, it will list the version of Quick or HTTP3 you are using, or just H2 if you're not using Quick or HTTP3. And that's it. Three different ways to check if you are using Quick or HTTP3 on your website. Thank you everyone for watching. If this video was helpful for you, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please leave them down below. Bye.